And this is where we begin to see an overlap and a connection between these two staves. One ledger line above the bass clef is the same C as is one ledger line below the treble clef. This C is actually perfectly between these two clefs, and so we give it the name middle C. But because we can actually see a connection between these two clefs, we're able to put them together, treble clef and bass clef, into one grand staff. Much of the music that we look at as musicians will actually utilize the grand staff because of its versatility, so it's a good thing to master before we go any further. And I encourage you to practice this on your own as well to help translate the music you see.